De regreso aquí en Auto 060 y como les decía, vamos a hablar, vamos a dedicar la segunda parte de la edición de esta semana a todas las declaraciones que nos dio Pelé ahí en el estadio de Santos, en la, en la ciudad donde se crió como futbolista, donde hizo prácticamente toda su carrera, estableció una cantidad de récords, eh, no solamente como de partidos jugados, sino lo más importante, quizá el, el jugador en la historia del mundo, en la historia del fútbol, que ha anotado más goles, principalmente con el eh, Santos Football Club. Así que aquí están varias declaraciones de Pelé, eh, embajador de Volkswagen en Brasil y en el mundo, eh, justo antes del Mundial de Fútbol Brasil 2014. So, on behalf of Volkswagen, I can tell you that we're very proud to present you <coughs> one of the famous, if not the most famous, football players in the world. And of course, some days prior to the World Cup, until the first kickoff will be done, we're very glad to have Pelé in his dressing room of his home club, Santos, nearby uh, his hometown. So, for you, exclusively, to answer your question. Pelé, how, how high is your World Cup fever a few days before the opening game? Yeah. Unfortunately, inside of the field or outside of the field, you ask? Uh, outside, outside of the field. <laughs> yeah, outside of the field, yeah. uh, we, we worry a little bit about the manifestation, the, 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 the protest, but uh, I think during the World Cup will be okay. I hope it's no, no problem. Because I used to say, let's say Brazil, always, no, uh, promote you know, the country with the football. Now, since I started to play in, in uh, 58, I was in, in Sweden. Nobody knows what, or, or, or in Brazil, when it was where Brazil. Then a lot of uh, reports there. They say, oh, Brazil is Argentina. Brazil is Uruguay <laughs> in 58. And then the football promoter was yeah. And then uh, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a very, very sad, you see, the political situation, you know, try to change this, this situation now during the World Cup. But uh, I hope that the, the World Cup will be fantastic. How would you describe the atmosphere in your country before the World Cup? Yes, that's what I mean. Yeah. And then I, I take this opportunity to yeah. tell to the people that yeah, the football, you know, always promote Brazil, always bring you know, good you know, uh, promotion to Brazil. Uh, the political situation is different. You know. I think that the, the, the team, the Brazilian team, the national team, that has nothing with the corruption of the political. You know. We could play anywhere. You know. People complain about the state, but this is not problem of the players, but problem of the national team of Brazil. Because the national team of Brazil always promoted the country. That, that's my opinion. Okay, let us go on the pitch. What is your favorite team for the cup? Uh, I hope Brazil won the World Cup. Uh, I saw this in the last, last two years. I can say. I was in Europe, I saw some games. And um, in Europe, the, the two best teams is uh, uh, Spain and Germany. Because uh, so several games, no doubt. Uh, this this is what uh, my opinion you know, is fine. Because Spain played very good, it has a team well organized. And the German it was uh, the best, the two best in the world. Of course, you must to respect uh, England is the best the Italian, and you have to play against. But I say in the moment. You know. What do you appreciate in the style of German playing? Is that was uh, this last two years the, the games we were so was a big change. You know, the play more forward, more, more, more control, uh, the, the, the more or less Brazilian style. Pelé, você fica muito muito preocupado porque tem tantos atrasos nas obras, nos aeroportos e e nos estádios. Você está preocupado por causa disso? Are you preoccupied with the delays? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Eu, eu fico preocupado, muito preocupado. Eu já também já dei várias entrevistas falando que, infelizmente, isso não poderia acontecer, porque eu, eu me lembro, há uh, cinco anos atrás, eu, nós estivemos 
quando teve a votação, para quem ganhou, o Brasil ganhou, eu estava lá, depois veio o presidente Lula, veio, isso não foi ontem. Então, eu acho que tinha tempo né, suficiente para terminar os estádios, e infelizmente, principalmente o estádio onde vai ser a primeira, primeira partida, né, em São Paulo, do, do, não estava terminado aí. Isso é, é preocupante. E o que significa perder aqui? To lose, uh, I have experience to, to lose. <laughs> uh, I, was, I, I was young, very young, but uh, I have experience because uh, uh, my, my father was a football player, a soccer player, in the 50s. You know, the, the team who used to play in Bauru, in the park, they, they have a little you know, get together in my house, that I didn't have TV, it was a radio, you know, and then they start to listen to him. Because Brazil was very good at that time. Nobody expect Brazil lost it. was a big party in Brazil, big, you know, the fire, uh, the, uh, I say, fire war. Then uh, I saw very silence, you know. Everybody was, I said, what the hell? I was with the kids, another friend of mine. I was uh, nine years old. Then I said, what the hell? Then I, I come with my friend, two or two friends, come inside, of, uh, my father was closed to the radio, and another player called Ditinho, I remember, Ditinho was the other side crying. I said, what did happen? They said, Brazil lost the world. It so. <laughs> was, was, you know, was tremendous, tremendous, you know, silence. And this is this until, until now I, 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 I felt that. Then I, I say, I say, now, now I hope so. My son don't see me cry <laughs> because I don't want to have the same experience that we had. Favorite goal and favorite teammate. Yeah. <laughs> favorite goal and favorite teammate. So I have a lot to play, you know, with a good, good uh, partners. That's the reason I make a lot of goals. <laughs> um, I say, I say in Santos, when do we have a, a Coutinho, Pelé, Coutinho, Doval, I think Coutinho was the center for, for, for you know, for the team. And uh, in the Brazilian national team, it was not direct, but the Garincha was the player, because uh, I don't know if you, if you know, we played 12 years, almost 15 years together with the Brazil. When we play together, Brazil never lost. The man, Garisha, when they come to the field, during the 15 years, we never lost. Then Garisha, and, uh, we have a Tustown now. Yeah. Tustown was very interesting player too. But uh, I have a lot to, to have a good partner. <laughs> <laughs> <And favorite goal. laughs> My best goal. That's, a, that's, a, that's difficult to say. I think, I think we have a lot of very important goals in the moment different in my life. For example, in 58, my first goal when Brazil qualified, because we did one new, was my goal, then Brazil qualified for the final. This was very important goal. And then the 1,000 goal, what, you know, America now was fantastic. Some people say, ah, oh, but it was a penalty. But it was 1,000 goal, was a penalty. <laughs> and then I, I I think I have more difficulty in this penalty because for the first time I shake my my because I I put the ball on the, on the mark then I start to say everybody starts to I start oh my God if I miss this penalty <laughs> <laughs> it was difficult for me but some people doesn't understand that because oh, I was a penalty but this was a very important thing. So I, I think this too was different uh, after the the goals against Italy. The World Cup. It was fantastic it was by head, and it was the final Brazil was champion. Uh, but now I have something very important. I, I mentioned it all the way. Uh, all the goals I, I scored in my, my career, you know, 1,283 to remember you. <laughs> but when I go to Europe, everybody asks the, 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 the player in the, the 70s. What, who was not to go? The dribbling Mazubi caps against Uruguay, the, this dribbling, the kick from the midfield, 
não acredita em Tchecoslováquia, já the head who bugs say the people always they ask about this kid was not go. I say I scored a lot of goals. Just ask the who was not go because the the, the 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 moment the player was very very good, beautiful, but was not go. <laughs> Uh, listen, when they start to play, we used to play in, in uh, Interland of São Paulo. They used to say the same about it is now. But uh, you know, if you don't care, nobody pay attention because uh, I have a lot of problems with it. They say the player now they they they, they throw bananas, but uh, they used to to play mango. They used to play uh, uh, <laughs> Orange, <laughs> they used to play everything, bananas in my time. But we didn't give attention to them because this is stupid to people. Uh, in that case, for example, uh, 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 if he doesn't get the, the, the banana, nobody knows what happened because they saw maybe it was a shoes, maybe it was a piece of you know, wood. But he get the banana, he make the joke, make it more important. But uh, this is uh, the same thing who always we have in football. Always we have in life the good people, the bad people. This isn't, that is not, that's not gonna change. Este programa fue una producción de National Latino Broadcasting.